Hello! In this video, we'll tell you how to activate your account. In the settings of your account, fill in the fields in the sections with a red icon. In the Company Information section, you have to fill in the following fields in English. Select the city from the drop-down list according to the data from the company's registration documents. Address should be filled in without specifying your country and city. You need to specify only the street and the house or building. The maximum number of characters is 50. When filling in this section, carefully monitor the accuracy of the provided information, especially the full name of the company and the number of the registration document. It must be the same in all documents as well as in your account. Please make sure that the letters and numbers are written correctly, otherwise the system will refuse your documents. The next section is Company Documents. You have to upload an original document confirming the state registration of the company in PDF, JPEG or PNG formats to this section. The uploaded original document must be clear, of good quality and in color. If your country is not listed, please upload a document with the registration and tax number that will confirm the state registration and tax registration in your country. If the registration and tax numbers are in different documents, combine them into one file. The size of the attached document must not exceed 32 megabytes. The last section where you need to fill in in the main fields is Payment Details. Here you need to fill in Account Number a number of the beneficiary bank account. Don't use special characters, spaces, and Cyrillic characters. The minimum number of characters is 6, the maximum one is 34. For accounts in IBAN format, the minimum number of characters is 13, the maximum one is 34. SWIFT – an identification code of the beneficiary bank. After entering the SWIFT code, all the necessary information about the beneficiary bank will be filled in automatically. If you enter an incorrect or non-existent SWIFT code, the system will report an error. To continue the registration, enter the correct code or specify the SWIFT code of another bank that will be able to receive your payments. Currency The settlement currency under the Commission Agreement with Ozone the settlement currency is selected on the stage of registering a seller account. You can change the currency after that. If you still want to change the currency you have already chosen, then you should create a new account and choose the currency you need. Please note that when uploading products, you should specify the product price in the currency that you have chosen as the settlement currency. The selected currency is fixed in the contract with Ozone and in the settings Details and Contract – Agreements section of the seller account. Depending on your country, the currency of mutual settlements can be different. China – USD CNY Turkey – USD Rubles Europe – Euro Rubles Other – USD Rubles When selecting Russian rubles as a currency of mutual settlements, you have to fill in additional fields in the corresponding bank details section. To learn more, please scan the QR code on the screen. Click Send for Verification. You'll receive an email to activate your account. Done! In case of incorrect filling in information about the company, errors in documents or payment details, or the moderation of documents lasts longer than usual, Please contact our technical support service or write to us at marketplace.crossborder at ozone.ru. Your personal account is activated. Now you can start working on the Ozone platform. Before you start uploading products, please find more details about the sale restrictions in the following video.